guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Morgan, if you're new here. Today, as you guys can see from the title, I'm gonna be showing you guys a tour of my car. I have the 2017 Honda Accord Sport, and the color that I have is the white orchid pearl. I must say that I really, really love this car despite having to get it of being in an accident back in November, but praise to God, I'm still here, I'm still alive, I'm still thriving. Um, if you guys like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up, make sure you subscribe and turn on my post notifications so you'll never miss an upload. And without further ado, let's get into my car tour. Alright guys, so I wanted to show you guys what I use for my keys. And this round thing I got from Amazon, it was about $10. And I think this is a new trend because I've seen like a lot of silicone rubber ones. And the one that I have is in leopard print. I could drop the link in the description below. And then also, I have some pepper spray because I think us ladies and men need to protect need to be able to protect ourselves in case that situation ever happens um i also have my you fit lime card rest in peace because the gyms are closed and then i have my set of house keys and then i have my actual car key right here and this case that i got is from amazon and i think it's so cute it was a little bit on the pricey side but I really wanted it and this is pretty much what it looks like with the Honda emblem on the key ring and then the actual leather casing on the keys so I thought that was really cute and then uh, the last thing that I have is let's see if I can do this one-handed the last thing that I have is this key pouch, which is my Louis Vuitton key pouch that I keep on my keys in the Damier Abin print. And yeah, that's pretty much everything that's on my key ring. All right, so let's go ahead and do another 360. This wheel though, 360 of my car, maybe 180. And let's go ahead and take a look under this hood. You put this stick here. Alright guys, so one of the things that I really like about this car that I mentioned earlier is the color. This car is featured in a white orchid pearl. If you followed me before, you would know that before I had a 2007 Toyota Yaris in the color black. And something about me, something just told me, get a white car. Uh, honestly, I think it was one of the best decisions of my life. Um, let me know in the comments if you think washing a black car compared to a white car is harder. I think for me, I think white cars are a little bit more difficult to maintain as far as keeping clean. But I don't know. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. One of the things I also like about this car that's featured in the Honda Sport Edition are the wheels. I really, really like how classy and how sporty the wheels are looking. Compared to my last car, this was not even a thing. So like I said, it's just amazing that I even got this car. Um, let's go ahead and bring it inside to show you guys what's featured inside of the car. So I'm inside the car and it's so beautiful. Like this inside just won me over completely when I first bought it. I really like this Honda emblem that's on the steering wheel and it's all leather. Now one thing that I did want to note is that this is the um, Honda Accord Sport. They do have a special edition and on the steering wheel as well as on the um, seats there is a red lining and the seats are all leather. So as you guys can see, as you guys saw from the seats that I showed you earlier, um, those seats were half leather and then they had cotton on the bottom part of the seats. So this is a steering wheel. I actually really like the feel and the grip of the steering wheel. I think it's, it's 
just it's so smooth and it's very nice now on the door, this is leather as well, and then there is a touch of carbon fiber on this part of the car. Another part that I really, really like about this car is this, which is eco mode. And once I turn this on, it's featured right here with a green leaf and it saves me a ton of gas. I get about 400 miles on this car in a single fill up and it takes me about $35 and we're in May 2020. So gas prices are around 170 or so and I do regular gas 87 so that saves me a ton ton of gas so i really love that and then i want to take you guys up to the dashboard and i know in the 2018 that is completely electronic i want to say it's digital um but i really like how the dashboard looks and then you have this right here which you know displays music and then time and i could um, set it, but I'm not gonna play it because of copyright. But that's how you play your music, and then this is how you turn your stations. You do FM, AM, CD, aux, and then your aux is featured right here, so that's really cool. And then this is how you adjust the AC on. And then you can turn it up, down. I think it goes about as high as 80, but I don't want to turn it all the way up because it's hot in Florida right now. All right, and then you have the option for your passenger to set their own temperature right over here. And then if you want to have it together, you can sync it. And then I also have this car freshener that I got from Bath & Body Works. I actually received this as a gift, so it's very useful. I got this back in December and I still smell it and it's around May, so these are very good and worth it and I highly recommend it. The scent that I have is Warm Sugar Vanilla or Vanilla Bean Noel. It's one of them, I can't remember. All right, so let's go ahead and take it down below. I have this little area where I can store. I usually store my sunglasses and whatnot. And then I have this to charge my phone and my other devices. And you can just pull this up and store more things. And then you have another USB. So I think that's very useful to store things. And here is the Cinder console. And what I have in here is I have a bunch of crap in here. I have some Bath and Body Works lotion, and this is in Mango Mandarin. And then I have some headphones. And then I have this, this is amazing. I love using this after I wash my car. This is just a air freshener, a spray air freshener that I usually put in this right here to spray it in the vents. And once you have the AC on, it just blows. And then I have some coupons and other stuff in here. Wallets, face mask, cause Corona 2020 has taken over. And that's all I have for the center console. Now we're in the back seat and I'm pretty short, but I have a lot of room. You can pull the seat down. I am 5'3 and I have about this much space. I think there was a good, this car is huge guys. This car is really huge. So my dad who's 5'10 could fit back here with plenty of headroom. Somebody who's six foot could probably sit back here with plenty of headroom. So this is a, Accords are very, very big cars. All right, so when you get to the back seat, you have the middle compartment and this features two cup holders and this whole middle section is full leather. So this is very, very nice. Now, when you get to the other two back passenger seats you have this leather part right along this edge and then in the middle as far as on the bottom it's featured in a cloth material so this back is just extremely roomy and no complaints about this back now i just have a bunch of junk in my back trunk so I have a bunch of sweaters for work, some scarves, another sweater, a heater, and this is my pad that I use for the gym when I wanna put it on the barbell. I got some shoes, some grocery bags, some more shoes, and then under here I should have a tire. 
and then I have some cleaner, some cleaning supplies. So I have leather cleaner wipes, and then I have microfiber cloth, and then I have more leather cleaner. I lied, this is um, to wipe the surface of the car. Some more cloths and some more cleaning supplies. And that's about it for what's in my trunk. And I think I have some WD-4 and now let's get some sticky residue off of my car. So that's it for the trunk. And like I said, this is the Honda Accord Sport. All right guys, so that is it for my car tour. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like I said, the reason that I got this car was really because I got an accident back in November and my 2007 Toyota Yaris was completely totaled. But like I said, but by the grace of God, I was able to get this, um, I was able to get this car right out of college. I had just graduated and everything. So it was just a complete shock to me but it was an early um, Christmas present to myself. So I really like it. I'm really glad that I got this car in white. I'm really glad that I got the sport car. I think it was a really good choice for me. Um, one thing I will say is that I did want the special edition that has the red lining on the steering wheel as well as full leather seats and red, red lining on the seats. I think that's really the only difference. Um, I also did want the 2018 edition of this car, which has a lot more features. Um, I know it has like Apple CarPlay, push to start, all of that stuff, but um, it was a little bit more on the pricier side and I decided to settle for this one. Um, I did want to get the special edition, but um, I needed a car and they didn't have that one um, available for me. Um, so. I did get this car, but the only difference are the seats and the steering wheel. So I think I can live without it. This car is just amazing and I love it. I hope you guys like this video. Make sure you give me a thumbs up if you like this video. Make sure you subscribe and make sure you turn on your post notifications so you'll never miss when I upload a video. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.